<laughs> That's because you can't get it, man. Yeah, bro. He can't lose that Virginio. He can't lose that Virginio. He can't lose that that Virginio. <laughs> yeah, man. <laughs> yeah, bro. But let's hear what this fool got to say. Let's go check out what this fool got to say. Let's check out this video anyway, man. <laughs> <laughs> Let's hear what this fool gotta say. This fool gotta say. Yeah, man. <laughs> I lost my virginity to a tricycle, bruh. Totally worth it. Was a learning experience. <laughs> Greetings, lovely people, and welcome to another lovely episode with your friend, Polly Boy, aka. HV, aka the handsome virgin. Now, today, there are five things I want to talk to you about. These are five benefits, five points of value that you can add to your life. Hopefully, it's not too late, but even if you have lost your virginity, you can still do something about your situation in that regard now this video is about why i'm a virgin why i choose to be a virgin why i am a virgin on purpose so here are the benefits of keeping your virginity so one you have a standard you are not diving into whatever swimming pool you come across. Now, I'm not saying that those who have lost their virginity, who are not keeping it, that they don't have standards. What I am saying is that when you keep your virginity for a certain person, you have an even higher standard just like a monk has a much higher standard than a regular person or than a person who does not meditate he has the standards he sets just like a student who is studying who is working hard who is doing something with his life or someone who is working at his passion is doing something with his life has a greater standard in regards to what he spends his time on than someone who is just lying on the couch and watching cartoons so the good thing about having a standard is it is a magnetic characteristic Depending on how you use it, it can be a great quality. It can be an attractive trait. Now this attracts people, certain kinds of people. It can also draw respect. It can also draw admiration. Just like going through any struggle can draw admiration if you are a vegan for 10 years in your life okay I don't know how much admiration veganism draws but you have drawn my admiration personally because for me it is not easy to live off vegetables alone so you have a standard any girl can't just get you they like that they like that they like that because you are now raised above the regular guy who can be accessed but now if even a hot girl can't get you even if she wants to hmm, you've got something benefit number two time 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 how much time have I wasted of my life? HV, how much time has yours truly wasted of his life 
trying to make out with girls. I can tell you, my friends, that I have wasted a great deal of my time kissing women. <clears throat> and I'm not happy about that dark cloud. The only thing that I'm happy about is the silver lining that shows me I should not do something like that again. Now imagine I had wasted my time sleeping with women. How much time I would have wasted. How much time I would have spent walking around looking for them. Being addicted to that. Living for pleasure. Walking into pubs and clubs and things of the sort and malls. When I could have been using that time for the development of skills, for the improving of life, for the bettering of society. But instead, in this hypothetical theory or example, I was sleeping with a woman. A pointless pleasure that in long term hurts you. So time, if you are serious about achieving your dreams, listen to this. Number three, money, moolah, green. The kind of money spent sex is a ridiculously tremendous amount one that I am glad I have not spent now that money could have been used to draw you a step closer to success a step closer to victory a step closer to your dreams if you analyze, if you take a look, if you examine today's society and our communities and our people, you will come to the realization that the cost of dinner dates, the cost of taking one out, the cost of entertaining another human being being so that you can be with them in intercourse is not worth it in the end compared to what you can do with that money and the time time is also money with that money and that time you could have been using it developing a skill increasing a skill could have been using it to build onto your life, the life of your family members and the lives of your community. So money. Now I'm going to make a part two of this video and I will see you guys in the next one.